coach show, give us your thoughts on tonight's game. Oh, man, obviously the win is always great, you know, uh, starting the season 4-0. So uh, that's a very good co- very good team, well-coached team. Uh, always plays us tough. Uh, we always have battles. So it was good to come out on top. I think we, uh, you know, had some highs and lows. But obviously we had a really good fourth quarter defensively and made some shots. Yeah, you guys were able to turn that, uh, that corner a little bit past the second half. Right. What, what, what did you see defensively from your team that you were able to that deficit and cut in and, and build the lead and establish. Well, I think, you know, uh, in the start of the game, the attention to detail wasn't there. We were playing hard, and I told them guys we were playing hard, but we're not uh, focused in the little things. And they were getting easy shots. We were, uh, you know, weren't aggressive in certain areas we need to be aggressive in and, like, closing out and things like that. So I think in the second half, we turned around a little bit. Uh, I think it was a tough uh, third quarter for both teams. And then that fourth quarter, we really – uh, defensively, was uh, our detail was really good. And for you to get that spark in that second half, all oh, what, what did you what did you see from your team offensively that they were able to just starting to connect on shots that you normally practice those set plays if you want. And you guys were yeah. able to make those baskets tonight. Yeah, I mean, you know, like I said, coaching against Memphis is it's a tough really tough offensively because they pack the paint and they make you pass the ball. Like if you're a selfish team, it's, it's very tough to beat them guys. So they make you mo- drive multiple times, make you move the ball multiple times. And, and I think uh, we did that. And that was one of the things that we focused, focused in on the scout that we had to move the ball. We got to drive it multiple times and get easy shots. Looks like uh, making better every game. Yeah. Sorry about that last night. Yeah, 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 yeah. It takes, it's just, it always takes time, right? To, you know, the jail and then, know you know things that we want to do but I think every game is just a little bit better. What did you think about Jared? I know I know earlier this year when Memphis he had 24 points off the bench. Uh, what did you think about him starting tonight? Any difference in his playing or Yeah, I mean I, I just think it is well for us is you know he's so dynamic that you know it just puts stress on the defense right right away. So I think you know he took him a little time to get into his groove. He hasn't started for a while. But once he got settled and guys kind of knew where to uh, get get him shots, it was good. And uh, right now the Texans are actually leading. So really? We'll see how that turns out. Okay, okay. Yeah, so let's one, go. One more prediction. Yeah. Uh, I, 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 actually, Monday night. Monday night, the national championship. Who's in the national Washington championship? Is going oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Against Michigan. Against Michigan. So, yeah. Obviously, you know how I got to go for it. If you know where I'm from, right? My dad is a Hall of Famer at the University of Washington. That's right. Um, you know, uh, so, you know, he's every second watching every single game. So I'm going for you, Dub. All right. Well, I will tell you that I did go to the national semifinal. Uh-huh. And uh, actually, we uh, interviewed uh, Mr. Uh, was it Polk, actually. Yeah. Uh, and uh, he said that he was a Polk actor. Okay. Oh, yeah. Receivers. Yeah. Real nice. And I will say that watching those receivers reminded me of LSU in 2019. Okay. Really, really. Yeah. So, okay. you know, I, they say defense wins championships, but it was wide receivers. Right, and a quarterback. Our quarterback's tough. Yeah, he can make. He's, tough. he's actually going to go to the senior bowl. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, he's, he's you know, you like that story just because. Well, that's why I want to bring that up. I knew you'd rather talk about that than last time. Yeah, night. yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm going for University of Washington. I'm, 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 I'm going to go there. I almost yeah. went there, so. Yeah, no. Congratulations to that coach. Thank you. Washington. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Uh, Darius, uh, for you tonight, kind of like a little bit of a breaking out of a little shell because you had gone through a little bit of a struggle. Uh, from a statistical standpoint, but tonight you, you were able to break free, able to knock down a couple of big three pointers down the stretch, get a few loose rebounds. Just how, how did this one feel tonight? Oh, this one felt really great. Like you said, I kind of broke out of a shell. Um, statistically, I haven't been having a, my greatest games as of late. Um, you know, today was a great day, you know, for the whole team as well. Jermaine played well, Jared played well. We all really played well as, as a collective unit. Um, and, you know, me playing well is just, you know, just better for the team, I guess. Have your problems, do you think, been more of a mental thing? I mean, physically, you seem to be healthy. Is this one of those things you got into a rut? Uh, definitely a mental thing. You know, at, at the beginning, I wasn't really hitting shots that I usually make. So um, that was kind of frustrating me a little bit. And then, you know, I just got back in the gym and just continued working. The work I always going to show. So, you know, just trying to stay consistent with my routines and, you know, getting out of my slumps. Um, today I started 0-2, and 
And then, I mean, I don't know what I finished on from three, but, you know, personally, I kind of feel like it was kind of, you know, efficient, but, you know, you never know. Well, you know, I always brag on LSU, but actually I went to Ohio University. Mm-hmm. So uh, Preston went there. He's a pretty good player. Yeah, really good player. You know, really good player. You know, LSU, you know, it's a great university. I love LSU. I believe purple and gold until I die. Well, actually, so. I watched the replay of the uh, women's game in Missouri. Okay. So, yeah, Angel played great. Angel played great. Angel played great. Angel played great. Um, so we could talk about this all night, but I'll let you go. So, uh, okay. go Tigers and uh, go up there. So. Yes, sir. Right, the last one on my end. And, you know, if Scott was bringing up uh, the, the mental blood, but on, on the plus, plus minus ratio, you, you always seem to be on the plus side of things. Mm-hmm. What do you think? Well, work doing work for you doing that rut that kind of allowed you to have this little breakout game tonight. I'm really just trying to find my way with with the guys. Um, you know, we have a, a different group of guys than we had last year. Um, you know, I mean, we kind of got the you know the same guys. We kind of play the same way. Um, a lot of downhill guys. You know, not too many people shooting the ball on our team. We really like like to get downhill points in the paint. So uh, you know, just finding my way, finding my spots. You know, knocking down shots when I'm open or, you know, a little contested. Um, offensive rebound, you know, I got to get back to the glass. Um, regardless of the minutes I'm playing, I have to take care of business and do my job. Regardless of, you know, if I'm playing five minutes to, to 40 minutes, I just have to lock in and do my job. And, you know, that's been my motto to myself the whole year. Um, just do your job and everything goes to take care of itself. You know, Cam tonight had like eight points in seven minutes at one point. Oh, really? Level. And I, you guys are just all gelling well together. Yeah. I mean, all the guys, you know, two ways you were a two way one sub, you all right. just kind of coming together. And right. You know that for having been a two way player, it takes some things a lot. It definitely takes some adjustments. Um, you know, just finding the, the way other guys play. You know, Nate's out, so, you know, a lot of guys stepped up. Jared started this game. Um, Sean is always playing high level defense. Honest is always playing high level defense. You know, it was a, like I said before, it was a collective unit win. And, you know, we're 4 0. Are we about to go to OKC and try to get two more? Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Thank you.